Hi everyone and welcome back here on our Friday. In case you missed it, yesterday, October 10th, was a record-breaking day in some parts of the valley. Here in Fargo, we ended up tying the previous record of 86 set back in 2003. Grand Forks at the airport breaking the record by a degree that was set back in 1934. And Park Rapids breaking the record by two degrees. That previous record uh, set back in 2010, but previously in 1938. Looking at now outside, not record breaking today. We're going to be cooler in the 50s and 60s. Right now at 60 in Fargo, north breeze at 15 miles an hour. 59 in Grand Forks, northerly breeze at 13 miles per hour. Temperatures around the region, again, lots of 50s and low 60s. 56 in Baudette, 55 Roseau, 54 in Langdon. A few more low 60s down to the south. Park Rapids at 60, 61 in Alexandria and Aberdeen, 62 in Sisseton. We've got a few clouds down across the Southern Valley, otherwise primarily sunny for our Friday afternoon. Looking at temperatures by 5 o'clock, only around 63 in Fargo, 58 Devils Lake, 62 Grand Forks, and in Jamestown, 59 Thief River, Bemidji, 63 in Wadena. So feeling much cooler today behind a cold front that slid through last night. And in the wake of that cold front too, we've got a little bit of a north breeze today in addition to cooler high pressure. Now, later this evening, cloud cover is going to start to increase from the west to the east. So by 10 o'clock, we're looking at mostly cloudy skies. A few breaks in the clouds here and there, if you're hoping to see the northern lights tonight. The chance isn't as great as it was last night either, but just to keep that in mind. A few isolated showers move through overnight and into tomorrow morning. And then we've got another chance for some showers, primarily to the north and to the east, later tomorrow afternoon and into the evening hours, gradually decreasing cloud cover as well, but looking like a mostly cloudy day tomorrow. As far as temperatures go for our Saturday, a very fall-like feel, 50s and low 60s, quite similar to where we are today. Even cooler for the day on Sunday and a bit gusty too. We're going to see winds out of the north northwest, perhaps gusting over 30 miles per hour and temperatures only in the 50s along with partly to mostly cloudy sky, or partly to mostly sunny, excuse me. Monday morning and Tuesday morning, we're looking at a potential for widespread uh, freeze conditions. As temperatures drop below 32, we're looking at 32 Monday morning in Fargo, 31 by Tuesday morning. Then we do warm back up a little bit more with morning temperatures in the 40s and afternoon highs in the 60s and low 70s. All in all, still not looking at much moisture in the forecast. We've got a chance for tomorrow hit and miss. And then again, <laughs> next Saturday, not looking too impressive either. Yeah. Wow. Going from 85 to frost warnings. Yeah. It blows it, my it mind. It feels so much cooler. Feels well, good. Summer, I have a joke for you. Oh, and I think you're going to like it. But we'll see, okay. how does the moon cut its hair? Eclipse it. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go. Straight ahead at noon, <laughs> Earth has a new